Hi everyone, my name is Jeremy Benskoder. My name is Brandy Brace and our company is Atlantic Divide Games. We're a game development company that consists of people who work remotely. We're currently finishing work on Cube, a mobile game that is scheduled for release in April. Atlantic Divide Games was founded in 2014, but we've only been working on Cube since 2016. We have focused on building a team of core people, and the creativity and drive of these people truly make our company. We all work additional jobs contributing to the game in our spare time. Our commitment to overall quality, even in the smallest details, is what will lead to unique, story-driven, polished games. We switched our focus from PC to a mobile game to establish our workflow and experience game publishing from the mobile perspective. We decided to start small and work our way up. Additionally, we focused on Cube before getting into larger projects in order to establish our company values and demonstrate our commitment to quality. The monetization strategy of Cube is not like many mobile games. Cube is a simple game but with a lot of details that make it stand out. We don't force ads on the player and we provide the option to opt out of the ads completely. This will set the game apart from other similar games that rely on these techniques. We aren't designing around monetization. We are setting out to make a great game. It doesn't matter if 100 people play it or 100,000 people play it, as long as they enjoy it. Atlantic Divide Games is formed of people who have a vision, and Cubed is just the start. We want to establish a standard that people will be able to expect from our future games. We are expanding into PC and console gaming with our next release. This move will bring with it the games that have a depth of story and design that we are trying to capture. We started making games because we love them, but we also want to make games that impress people, games that tell a story, and games that will leave an impact on the players. Part of the impact we hope to make is within the community. Having experienced the difficulty of finding local people who are interested in game design, we want to grow the industry through reaching out to the community and schools in the area. Making games is about more than creating something that matches the current trend. It's about constantly learning new skills and pushing yourself to be creative in your use of technology. As we grow our company, we hope to grow interest in game design in general, to get local people, students in particular, involved in the process of making games. We want to pursue and encourage others to pursue the potential that games have as an art form and as a means of storytelling. And while doing all that, we also want to make games that people enjoy.